Today I'm going to be reviewing this charger base for the iRobot vacuum. Now this is the actual one that's made by iRobot. However, what we did is we actually put command strips on the bottom to secure it to the floor. And the reason that we did that is our robot vacuum has a tendency to bump into this even when it's placed all the way up against the wall. And so what it'll do is it'll eventually move this enough where it won't be able to dock itself. And in that case, then it won't automatically charge and restart. Now we've had this uh, robot vacuum for maybe a year, year and a half, something like that. And something that we've also run into many times is that these metal contacts will constantly get black stuff on them. So you can kind of see a little bit on there how that it has a little bit of the rubber or black, and that's from the bottom of your robot vacuum. So what you will have to do quite regularly, I'd say probably at least every few weeks, is you're gonna have to clean these off by either rubbing them with your fingers, or they also say that you can use like a melanine sponge, so like a Mr. Clean eraser, or just a, a generic Mr. Clean, clean eraser, like a melanine, uh, melanine, I think melanine um, sponge that you can use to clean those contacts off. Now, one other thing that I wanted to mention about this is the fact that it does move, as I said, so you will likely wanna find a way to secure it. Like I said, we use the command strips. You can use whatever you want, but the problem is just pushing up against the wall will not actually allow your robot to keep it there. What'll happen is over time, your robot will hit this, hit this, hit this until it is at a weird angle. And then at that point, your robot will not be able to dock. So it definitely is a good product. Um, it works great with the iRobot vacuum. However, it does have those couple of downsides, cleaning the contacts, and then the fact that it moves. So I'd recommend finding a way to get it um, stationary so that way you don't have that problem with your vacuum constantly moving. When your vacuum is plugged in and it's charged, it will be green like that. So I have my vacuum attached and it is green so that you, way you know that your vacuum is charged. Overall, definitely a great product.